and I got a new radiator in the car. I'm gonna go quadding at Four Peaks. Maybe um, drive to to Saguaro Lake. Uh, it, it rained a lot last night, so I don't know what the trails are gonna look like. Got the quad in the back there, and just just some basic things. Maybe six bottles of water. And uh, go out there for a few hours, have some fun, kick up some dirt or mud, who knows. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, and there's uh, there's Red Mountain right there. And uh, off we go into the wild blue yonder. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. All right, we got four peaks over there. You can't really tell because the top of it is actually uh, clouds uh, covering the, the actual peaks itself. And uh, my left here, that is Fort McDowell, the uh, casino. Maybe we'll stop during the way back and win some money or lose money. Maybe we won't go at all. <laughs> Yeah. Um, not too far to go. Hey, that'll take you to Sparrow Lake uh, if you want to drive there by car and uh, you know, go fishing off the dock where you unload your boat. But uh, we're going to go there, but we're going to use the quad. And. Uh, yeah, Four Peaks is uh, still covered up by, I should say, hidden by clouds. And uh, Mason, 53 miles. All right, well, we made it to the parking lot. There's only a few people here, so. It's kind of good. Less traffic out there. We're gonna probably head that way towards Saguaro Lake. Yeah, it's really quiet out here. It's awesome. Maybe we'll see some rattlesnakes today. Just gonna take this down and get out there. Why don't you come with? Well, I stopped in a little valley here. And from here you can actually catch your first glimpse of Saguaro Lake. So that's the way we're heading. We're right now we're on 1813 is the number of this trail. Of course it's real windy right here. And right where I stopped, uh, I'll see if I can find him. Uh, there was a road runner. A nice, uh, nice brown colored uh, road runner. So, uh, yeah, there's the lake. And we're going to try to uh, get to Saguaro Lake at some point. I'm going to see if I could find this uh, Roadrunner. Got a nice shot here of uh, Saguaro Lake. And that is today's destination. 
see Weaver's Leaf Needle uh, off to the left over here. So, uh, really nice. Too bad I didn't bring my fishing pole. Close to the uh, to the lake, a little lizard right there, and uh, it's it's really cool to be in this canyon like this, surrounded. It's pretty neat. So it's definitely a lot cooler in here too. Yet. Uh, I'd like to see one and be able to film another one, but part of me says uh, it's fine, I don't have to see one. I definitely smell the water. There it is. Ducks here. All right, so this is Saguaro Lake. Hear a few boats out there. This guy, I don't know what he wants. He keeps keeps talking to me. I don't got any food, buddy. Got nothing for you, buddy. Well, here we are at the beautiful Saguaro Lake. We got some boaters out there tubing.
we got three birds over here that want to commandeer my vehicle. Got here. Oh, he just moved. Let's see if we can get a shot of him. A woodpecker. I mean, not a woodpecker. Uh, we got here. It's hard to see him. He's a roadrunner. There he goes. I also noticed this here. Some fire ants. Hard at work there. Excellent. Four Peaks finally decided to show his face. Yeah. So we got Four Peaks. Weaver's Needle. And a nice shot of part of uh, Saguaro Lake. And you got a little bit more. Over there. Nice. I'm getting hungry. I think it's time to uh, head on back. All right. It's the old watering hole it's where they used to load the uh, cattle up there couple different pens and stuff. Not sure how long ago this was being used, but uh, it's been uh, dilapidated for quite some time. Alright, onward. There's four peaks. All right, it's been another, uh, another great ride. Got to see the lake, Roadrunner, <laughs> and a lot of dirty, dusty trails. So uh, I'm glad you came with, and uh, we'll see you again on the Grand Adventure. <laughs>